The world has fallen into darkness. Misguided world leaders have now led us to the brink of world war. American troops fighting Russian troops. I can I can tell exactly what's going to happen as the worst scenario or yeah. the master scenario. We're all going to die. All while the elites of society insist on mocking God to His mighty face. Why do you commit whoredoms and spend your strength with harlots? Evil forces that resist God. <laughs> it's a nest of antichrist demons. Amen. Amen. They are a satanic camp of sworn enemies to God that resisted him. Amen. They're true, they're so yes, hypocritical. It's true. They really are, they think they're good. You are watching the Ezekiel Fungus Bible Prophecy Show. Greetings, beloved. Welcome to another episode of Ezekiel Fungus Bible Prophecy Show. I am your host, Bible teacher, Ezekiel Fungus. And this is the show where we read the Bible and we discover what it has to say about these end times which we are living in. And joining me is my dear friend, Brother Dabney Dubochins, as well as former President of the United States, Donald J. Trump. Well, we've had many disturbing events this week at the very prestigious Super Bowl. We saw a member of the Spice Girls conjuring up demons to try to get her favorite team to win. Mm. And even the very uh, uh, dependable Kanye West released uh, an album that, kind of, that sounds demonic. It's called Vultures. Oh, why couldn't he put a Christian uh, animal like uh, ducks or chickens, but no, he has to pick vultures. Mm. I mean, what the heck's wrong with the music today that these kids are making? It's, it's really weird and all these satanic themes. I mean, I know S Satan was the, the the prince of the choir in heaven or some kind of jazz like that, but come on, man, this stuff is weird. No, Ezekiel, if I may interrupt your nonsense for a moment. I did catch up with Kanye recently for a future episode of Pig on the Loose to try to get an interview and, well, th this is how it went. Hey, Kanye, do you know how stupid you look wearing black pantyhose on your, over your head when it's 90 degrees out in California? <laughs> oh, ow! Kill me, what are you doing? Ouch! Calling the police. Police! Being assaulted here. I have piglets. I'm a journalist. What's your language? Please, I've just been assaulted by Kanye West. It wasn't dumb. I thought we were in Antarctica. What the? You got free will, or you work for the devil? Oh, I work for Lucifer. I knew there were lots of pigs in the fake news media, but this is getting ridiculous. Oh, look, President Dum Dum has finally decided to chime in. President Trump, let me just ask you point blank. We've heard Kanye speak of working for the devil. Do you believe today's rock music, outside of the village people, of course, is satanic? Uh, Ezekiel, let me tell you, I love all of today's pop music stars. In fact, you might be surprised to know I loved Taylor Swift. But after she endorsed Biden in 2020, I loved her 50% less. And when she started dating Travis Kelsey, I love their 50% less even more. And if she endorses Biden again, like some fake news outlets are reporting, 
Allah, fifty percent less yet again. Ugh, Trump, you moron. That adds up to one hundred and fifty percent. That makes no sense. Excuse me. I don't need a lesson in mathonomics from bacon brains over here. What? Oh my. Well, speaking of lessons, we all know what that music means. It means today's Bible lesson has come to a close. We've run out of time. So God bless every one of you. I'll see you next time. I'll see you in the glory.